Hey, what's up, everyone? James Hurst with The Marketing Show, and I've got a very special guest to introduce you today. Welcome to the show, Ahmad Rashid. How are you? I am good. Thank you so much. How about you, James? What's up? Yes, I'm good, man. Hey, so this is GHL Boy. I have I have known about Ahmad for probably, I don't know, six months to a year. I think we've we've chatted. We've, we've known each other for a little while. Uh, and it wasn't until the other day he reaches out. He says, James, you got to take a look at this thing I've made. I've made a, I've made the ability to clone workflows. Like this is the thing we've all been waiting for. This episode is sponsored by Extendly for High Level. If you haven't met the good folks over at Extendly, uh, you ought to take a look and see what they have to offer. They're one of the bigger support agencies in the high level space right now. So they, they have a snapshot store with completely crazy built out snapshots, uh, white label onboarding support and training high level dashboard customization, as well as training uh, from the Blairs, the Academy for High Level, Melissa and Stephanie Blair. So I had a chance to meet Bayant in person just recently in Dallas at the Sasspreneur event. We had a chance to get to know each other better. I've also been working with them and teaching and coaching in their Facebook group. And you may have seen some of my tips and tricks videos that I put on for them as well. So if you haven't had a chance to take a look at Extendly, go to getextendly.com. That's getextendly.com. Now back to the show. I made a video a long time ago about how to, you know, uh, do a, a double snapshot method where you'd make a new account and then you you do a double snapshot to be able to share a single workflow. Uh, that's great for outside of your account. He's got something I'm, he's going to show us uh, today how to clone workflows across uh, sub accounts. And I am so excited because it's going to save me a ton of time. So Ahmad, tell us a little bit about what you've done. Okay. So that's kind of a cool add-on for go high level agencies you know who wants to clone uh, workflows from one sub account to another sub account within the same agency you know earlier you had a method of snapshot and then the double snapshot which was like pretty <laughs> clean but it was time taking oh and but this one it's just two or three clicks you can yeah. clone a workflow or you can clone the whole folder with multiple workflows to another location within the same agency so that's kind of very cool and exciting yeah, let, so, me, uh, yeah. let me show them here. So you guys, so basically he says, hey, James, you're going to get you set up with this. Uh, and then it's, uh, hey, I just need to get your white label domain. He gives you a snippet of code. Let me go ahead and show you how that goes. So we just come over here, go to the agency view. And then he's going to give you uh, one. It's, this, is a, this is a paid product. It's hopefully it's well worth your, uh, your dollars here. But you're going to go to settings. You're going to go to company. And then you're going to, he's going to give you a snippet of code. And you just go to the bottom here. You might have some other stuff and you just paste in a little bit of code called the workflow copier. Okay. It's going to only works on your white label domain. So then what you do is you come over here to a sub account. For example, like I'm building GHL bounty hunters. A lot of the stuff I've built over there, I need to bring it in over to my tech support.com. So what I'm going to do is go to go to a specific sub account. Once that thing is loaded and everything, then you're going to go to your automations and you'll notice that there's a new tab. It's called workflow setting. Okay. So check this out. So if I click workflow setting right now, you can see that it's, I'm either able to copy the entire folder or I can copy individual workflows. So if I copy the folder, it's going to get everything uh, in the folder, right? And then you would pick the location where you copy it to. And we're, we're going to do a demo. Now he knows that that's a little bit there. He's going to make it a little bit wider. What's really cool yep. is that what's really cool is that since he is managing the code from that script, he can, I assume you can push live updates, right? You don't have to re update. Like it, right? within no time, not at all. Yeah. So he's able to make it better on the back end uh, without having you to install another plugin or anything else, which is really slick. That's really smart. So let's just do a test. Okay. So first let me, let me get this up. Real, let me just, um, what I'm going to yeah. do is I'm going to go to a new account. Uh, just show you that there's nothing there, right? Okay, so we're going to basically demonstrate the fact that we're going to copy something over. So let's go ahead and go to demo here. Demo account. Let's see. Let's see if I have anything in here. So I'm in my demo account here. And I'm in, okay, so I have like, uh, what do I have? I have just like five workflows as total. That's all I have in here. So let's go ahead and go back to the Bounty Hunters website. And then let's go ahead and do that. Let's clone uh, a folder and everything in it. And then let's clone uh, that one and then this one. Now notice this one's in draft and this one's in published. And I'm gonna go ahead and pick that demo account. And I actually just searched DEMO. So it's actually, that's pretty cool. That's, that's really nice. It's a nice help. Uh, so I was just typing DEMO, a demo account. And then let's go ahead and hit click here to copy selected. 
All right, you can see it. You can see it's doing its thing right here, copying all those things. Let's let that sit. Let's come over here, hit refresh. And he was saying that it's going to maintain the status. If it was published, it's going to be published. If it's going to be, um, if it was dropped, a draft, it's in draft. Okay, you can see. So there's the one that's in draft. You can see there's the uh, up last updated date. And if I come in here, there's my there's my uh, folders worth of copy. Okay, so there's a draft. Now, where's the one that is this the one that we just brought? Oh, right there, right. So right there is the other one. And if you just do the new sort feature, you can see exactly what you just brought in just today. Those ones right there. You guys, this is amazing. This is going to save some people so much time. Now you got to be asking yourself, wait, uh, you know, some of the, there's dependencies. Why hasn't high level done this yet? Right? Cause it's kind of complicated because you know, there's tags in your other account, there's users, right? So just take this for what it is. Uh, he, he, like you said, he's going to be working on things. If there was a tag in your old account, maybe he can automatically create that tag for you and just help, help that come across. But you know, you're going to need to go into each one of these that you copied over and just make sure that, okay, well, Hey, I assigned it to this user. Okay. Well, look, it's blank. Well, yeah, you're going to need to wire those things back up. Um, you guys, he's selling this for like, I mean, what, 500 bucks, 300 bucks, or what, what's the deal? What are you going to make the deal for my, for my audience here for the marketing show? Make, okay. Make so yeah, we actually delete didn't make it like too worthy, uh, you know, because uh, as you have seen the value for this add on. So like we have make it so that every agency, even if they are on pro plan or they don't have much clients, but yeah. because it's kind of basic necessity for every agency. So that's why we have made it for 119 USD lifetime deal. There's okay. no monthly, no okay. recurring fees. So All right. yeah, I mean, you know what, yeah. eventually, you know, someday, let's just be honest, someday high level might come out with the the amazing Definitely. thing, but like, yeah, but in the meantime, hey, 120 bucks, 119 bucks, uh, get with GHL boy right here. And like, you know, it's going to be worth, it's going to be worth it. I mean, you probably save your money and your in time spent here within just a few copies. So let me guys, yeah. let me put you in touch with how and to get also, uh, with James, you. you forgot one thing to What's show that? them demo. Yeah. How, what about if they want to clone a specific workflow, which is inside a folder, they don't want to clone the whole folder, but oh, okay, they want yeah. one workflow specific within the folder, so, for example. Okay, so yeah. Go, okay. So they go inside of it first and then they, and then they workflow pick. Set. And then, okay. Yeah. So then that. now love they it. can pick. Yeah. Love it. Love it. Yeah, guys. So he's uh, thought of, he's thought of a lot of different things. Uh, if you guys want to get in touch with him, um, go ahead and reach out. He's always on Facebook right here uh right here uh, facebook.com and then your your a h m i i i i 58 or uh you can get in touch with him by email if that works better for you i got in touch with him info at jdfunnel.com uh, or they can just go to ghlboy.com website just okay. open up a new tab and ghlboy.com and they will also see very other yeah all right they will see right. like very other get click on custom add-ons get ghl add-ons the mm -hmm. second call to action yep Ooh, and so there are a lot, lot of this, others oh, this, as well okay so this is not your first tool is what you're trying to say <laughs> yeah this is not your uh, first tool okay where is that where is it on here i'm not seeing it uh, yeah hold on uh i think i have to put that but it should be there mm, okay okay but they can just reach me out from here they but can... i'm gonna put that demo here as well all right guys yeah. Guys, that's the workflow copier. You know, uh, I'm just now trying it out myself. I can't say that I've used it for months and months and years and years. There's not a single issue, but for 120 bucks lifetime deal, it's hard to go wrong. Dude, thanks so much for taking the time. And uh, yeah, you guys get in touch with him. And that, that, that being said, we'll talk to you guys later. Okay. Thank you. Bye, guys. Hope you enjoyed the show. Advice given is for educational purposes only and may not be applicable to your business. You should know that the marketing show receives compensation through its affiliate relationship for the products and services it recommends. Thank you for your support, and we hope to see you on the next episode of The Marketing Show.